headed north with my good friend Patrick. We've been doing trips together for many years now. This trip was his idea. He was working all winter up in this part of the country and thought a backcountry ski trip would be a good thing. Patrick is a professional cameraman, so naturally I loaned him my lower resolution camera for the trip. When it comes to my images, I'll take all the hardware help I can get. Unfortunately, I have an intestinal infection, and we're really pushing the limits of what I should be trying to do, so we're going to just have to see how it goes and try to exercise good judgment along the way. It was, there was a big old bowl, and the snowbank was so tall that he couldn't get, I mean, he couldn't get off the road. And I'm coming behind him on the bike, and I'm like trying not to push him to get him nervous, and around these dudes on a motorcycle, you are feeling exposed. Oh, yeah. Patrick and I live half a continent away now, and this is a great opportunity to get together and catch up on life and family and the world in general. verify focus on this but might as well do it now I got his head there we go oh, we're still rolling it's yeah, all good. good there he comes that's it right there that was a definitive little segment of video yeah well, in the snow and done about all we can with these critters <coughs> for the time being anyhow she would come back tomorrow and she'd be laid down in the same spot or the same area basically okay go ahead action it's they're not they're not exactly wild, but man, what an opportunity to catch some pictures and video of these creatures who at least live free and, you know, in a huge open park. Wow. As luck would have it, I'm awakened the next morning by a fair amount of abdominal pain. We make the decision to head back home so I can be near to medical care if I end up needing it. This is a, a reminder that we really need to cherish and make use of the time we have. You know, we don't know when the next trip's going to get short or when we're going to be able to put the next trip together. I'm grateful for my friend Patrick and the time we get to spend together. He ends up driving us all the way home in a very long, stormy day. We've learned some lessons on this trip and make plans for a better trip next year, presumably this time truly into the backcountry.